What's up everybody, Jackson Wilkie with the original Living in Houston, Texas team. Today, we are doing things completely different than we're used to. See, most of these videos, we are typically going into the community, showing the amenities, and then the houses from the highest price all the way down to the lowest. But today, we're flipping that, y'all, because we are gonna show you what just over $450,000 to $500,000 can get you. Now, there is a reason that the affordability is at its absolute max in this area, but you're gonna be shocked at the end of this video just how much house you can get. Oh, and you might be living on a lake, too. But before we get into any of these houses, we gotta do something special. Jojo, go do your thing, boy. They'll be stealing their keys, Jojo. <laughs> so we're gonna get you exclusive access. Jojo got the key. They got his ID, so if we run with it. <laughs> got the key, the ID. <laughs> they stole the goddamn house. But what we'll do is we're gonna show you through a few of these homes. There is so much that's gonna be built here, even in the next few years. In fact, there's already homes here on the resale market too. So a massive master plan community. And we're gonna show you these incredible homes, all of them of which 400,000 or less. Okay, so what we're gonna be doing is showing you what you can get for $200,000, for 300,000, then 400,000. And yes, at the end of this video, we're going to take you what 450 to 550, depending if you're on the lake or not, can get you. And it will be the most shocking reveal that you have seen in any of our videos. Oh, and did I mention that it has the biggest, uh, actually, I'm not even gonna tell you right now. I'm gonna have to show you about halfway through this video what it has. All right, Jojo, show us what we got going here. Yeah, right here, Jackson, look, right here, 3121. This house right here is right under 300 at 286.9, and it was over the 300 mark. They have reduced it. So well, let's go in and have a look. Now you got, got the key. Got the keys right here. <laughs> All right, the best part about this house, it'll be like no other house you've ever seen in Houston because it comes with its own taco truck. So you're gonna get the best tacos in Houston every single day, but no, they're actually framing out all of the houses for this builder right now in this cul-de-sac area. And that's what they do. Instead of building sporadically all throughout the development, they take one street and they got the sprinklers going. Oh, dang. Jojo getting wet. Woo. Hey, it doesn't feel half bad with it being this hot outside. All right, Jackson, so let's come on in and see what 1,600 square feet presents itself to be. Oh, thank God it's oh, cold. I love this new home smell. All right, so take a walk over here into the living slash den family room area. Not all of them have carpet, most of them they do. The good news is, is that it can be rolled up and placed with the matching flooring. But if you notice this open kitchen right here really opens up to this area. All right, so this is exactly what we wanted to show you is a baseline price of $286,000. So yes, you're not gonna have the 20 plus foot ceilings and all the upgrades, but this is a very nice, you know, 1600 square foot house. You can actually see the difference between being down south here and up north. Instead of having clay and dirt, you get some sand in the backyard but you will still get taller ceilings. These are not just your standard eight foot ceilings. You do have a pretty good sized kitchen and living room. You do have two full bedrooms and a full bathroom down there. And then here on the backside, you're gonna have a master bedroom. It's actually pretty decent sized. Again, this is going to be your absolute base model. And then from there, you can start upgrading uh, to get more space, two stories or whatever. So you're gonna have bathroom here, walk-in closet, all the stuff. Some of the lights they don't even have done yet. This is a house they're just finishing up. So this is what, you know, sub $300,000 is going to get you in this area. So I wanted to point out on this particular home, we wanted to show you what baseline is, what you can get in at their entry level price. You still get granite countertops, but a plus that I see Jackson is that you still get gas appliances. They have a refrigerator in this particular unit, which they're not all standard, really most aren't. And then the really cool thing is they have a tankless water heater in the garage, which is really great. And so seeing this bottom line here, Jackson, this space is great as you see you have tall ceilings here. It can only get better from here because this particular builder, their model, they have step ups and upgrades and amenities as well in the home, but also it, they cap out around right over 400,000 at 2,900 square feet. So there's a lot of choices out here. And like you heard earlier, they have over 160 homes left to build out here. Now, again, the reason that we are really flip-flopping this video is because 
the budget, right? The prices of these homes, you're getting massive homes. In fact, our next example is what you can get for just over $300,000. So a lot of the typical master plan communities that we go in that are tighter to Houston or up in the north, what you just saw in that last clip is what you're gonna pay 300, $350,000 for. So, and that is just that single level home. So now in that $300,000 range down here, this is what you get. All right, so this one's the middle package, two story home right under 2300 square feet 325 and as you can see it's unfinished but we wanted to show you uh, one of these houses that were kind of unfinished because a lot of people that come in from out of state they don't have a visualization of what a completed house looks like so this is a stage where they're still designing it but there's opportunity and one of the pluses jackson that i really do like when i see this stage is when someone calls us in and says they still need three months or their house is on the market in this particular stage it gives time exactly to finish out your house over there and move over here and have a finished out product and one other thing that i really do love about this house is that you have the primary bedroom on the first floor and not only that it's open you see the lighting up here it also has a separate tub and shower as well. I'm gonna turn on the old go-go gadget light here, Jojo. But you know what, Jackson? I wanna take you into a completed home next. Okay, so you're gonna show us what it's actually like to be in the one that's done. But yeah, this thing actually feels pretty It does, pretty it feels spacious. pretty real open. Really shocked at the size of the master and the, you know, the kitchen island space. This is a pretty good sized home. Put the big beam up in the center here to get the space and uh, sub 350 Joe this is a heck of a steal now here in a little bit I'm also gonna pull up the map and show you what's surrounding this area again you will not believe it and at the end of this video wait till you see what you can get in that $500,000 price range but the main reason this is the hottest new master plan community is because of this oh and by the way if you see me doing this a lot it was because my ears were so plugged from some kind of allergy I keep getting here in Texas, but I'm all good. Anyways, check it out. All right, here we are. Lago Mar, didn't even mean to rhyme. This is Texas's largest lagoon. Now, what I wanted to show you real quick, the old sign up there says Texas City. If we were to look just over these bushes here, you have 45. So right to the south of us, about 15 minutes, you're gonna be into Galveston and you're gonna notice the landscape down here will be a little different than some of the areas we go to because you're gonna have a lot of the palm trees. It almost has a Florida feel to it. Right here, you are gonna have new construction going for years and years. We're going to be showing you houses that you can get in that $400,000 range that are massive two-story homes and even, surprise, $280,000. So lots and lots to come here. But if we look just over my shoulder this way, you're gonna start seeing there's a lot of lake living, massive homes, gated communities. So a lot of this is already built out. There's already resale in this master plan community. So this is quickly becoming one of the most talked about master plan communities in all of Houston, Texas. A, for its affordability, but really B, because of that massive ass lagoon that we got behind us. But you also don't lack any kind of amenities or things to do, not only in the community, but within just minutes of here, you have all of your shopping, restaurants, bars, VA hospitals just across the way as well. And I did see a lot of signs for the VA we talked to a sales rep. They work with a lot of VAs here. So if you would, let's all give a like to all of our veterans out there. See how many of those likes we can rack up for the veterans. But we are gonna show you this master plan community and yeah, that massive lagoon over here. So here we are in what we're talking, you know, they have the 200s to the 500s, but this is gonna be kind of your higher end living, three car garage, massive floor plans. But again, you're gonna find a lot of these homes, even the new ones in that $500,000 range, and even some of the smaller ones down in the 400s. So lots of affordability down here, and that's why this area is just crazy right now. What do you think, Jojo? What do you think of this area? I like that it's it's something you can find on the south side of town. And not only that, it just gives you a lot of bang for your buck. So it's a lot of these houses again. Um, I know I've said it before, but these are a lot of houses that you do see in these master plan communities on the other side of town, on the north side of town, like in your Bridgelands, your, you know, Centera. This, this community, speaking of Centera, this is the same Land Tejas developer who builds over there in Centera. So if you see something here, it's more than likely over there as well. Which is also one of the top selling master plan communities it's in all of Houston. It's super popular. 
lot to do it's just it's a lifestyle like we were talking to one person what what what's the draw they were just like it just feels like a you know i wouldn't say retirement but it just feels like resort style living yep so now you're seeing a lot more of like your single level plan here and then across the way you get some massive two-story homes with the balconies and what do you see here jackson you also oh. anything under five hundred thousand, and you see gated community that's you know that's a diamond in the rough 500k as you can see behind us this is actually gated so yeah you're gonna get a lot of that luxury and big homes it looks like we're pulling up on some really big ones here but you're really not gonna have to holy moly we, we lost you stretch that budget a ton to to get into here okay so now what i have to do is i have to show you something on the map because we're gonna show you what just over four hundred thousand dollars can get you in fact these houses are selling like hotcakes, they're gone. So we weren't able to get into a furnished one, but first, actually, if we were to look on the map here, you're gonna notice that this area is all the way down to the south here, and that is why you could stretch that budget. But there's some really cool things about that. First of all, you have the big outlook of Houston, third largest city in the nation. This place is massive, right? But there's a lot of value by stretching down to the south here and you're not gonna be just kinda out there in the middle of nowhere. So if we come down, you're gonna notice that you have 45 right here that goes all the way down into Galveston. I love this. When we first moved here, this is the area that we lived. It takes you 10 to 15 minutes to get down to the beach, which is awesome. It's erupting down here. I could not believe how much growth is going on, but you can see Lagoon Fest, Lagoon. This is all of Lago Mar right here by Land Tejas. And as we've mentioned, we're gonna mention, this is the same developer as Sunterra, which is the number one fastest selling master plan community. The cool part is just to the north, if we were to head up here by Webster, the whole Baybrook Mall. So if you remember the Friendswood vlog that we did, that is the Baybrook Mall where you're gonna get high-end restaurants, shopping. You have the Tanger outlets actually just right here next to you. And you have a Bucky's gas station. And the cool thing is right over here, this is called Kima, and a lot of people don't know about this, but if, if you actually zoom in here, and I'll go to the satellite view, you can see that you have a massive complex right here, and it's actually a theme park. In fact, I hope I can, yeah, I can, I can throw us down here. So you have the Kima boardwalk, and you have a ton of you know carousels, and you actually have a wooden roller coaster, there it is over here, it doesn't have a crane on it right now, but you got a ton of restaurants, shops, bars, things to do right there. And it's just minutes away from you. In fact, if I actually pop this map out, you're going to notice that not only there, but everything right here is full of restaurants. In fact, this was actually on diners, drive-ins and dives with old Guy Fietti. And uh, he went there. This is our favorite restaurant down there. It's amazing. So you got a lot of really cool things to do. And the other thing that you'll notice is you have NASA Parkway. So right here, you're going to have massive complexes with the shopping. Obviously, you have movie theaters. You've got Top Golf. You have a lot of things going on, and it's just up to the north of you. So you can really stretch that budget, but you're not losing any of the amenities and all of the growth coming down this way. It makes it very easy to see why so many people are attracted here, not only including Texas's largest lagoon. But now you're gonna see what you can get for just over 400,000. It's amazing, almost 3,000 square feet. All right, Jackson, so right here, we're coming into the highest priced house that th this builder offers um, out here in this community. And as you can see, there's tons of lots still available out here. I will warn you about something, Jackson. When we go in this magnificent home for what they're offering, you're gonna see that it's not completely finished out, cleaned out. There are some unfinished things in here. And the reason why is because they're building these homes so fast and they're selling out so fast. As you see, this one's got a, a sold sign on it. But come on in and I'll tell you a little bit about it. Again, they are selling pretty fast. So they're not, they don't have anything completely finished out and complete. They're just building and they're selling. So. Um, that's why you see it in, in this stage right here. And we really did want to showcase a finished product. However, they just don't have one right now as people are moving into those. Holy Jojo, look at this thing. Yes. Big and tall. So again, I didn't mention what highest price means, right? So that is at $424,000 for 2,900 square feet space inside of the home. Notice the high ceilings, still get great windows. It flows very well. Primary still on the bottom floor. and. I know from there, Jackson, come over here and check this out. Okay, okay. Look at this galley style kitchen, brother. Dang. And that goes that, into the formal. That just over there. flows all the way over to the formal and then exits out to the front of the home. 
Okay. But look okay. at this counter space. Massive. Still got great detail on the backsplash. I really love that style right here. Well, that means you're going to have some tiny little master or what? Let's go check it out. Well, where are you sacrificing, right? Mm. You're not sacrificing. They have great space over here in the primary bedroom. Oh, More than holy. enough for king size bed. Actually, two king size beds, right? It's, pre it's pretty long. Two king size, yeah. But, Separate beds. And that's not reality. We know a lot of people put... All right, so not gonna lie there, our camera completely shut off because it got too hot internally. It is so hot outside today and the AC's not in here, but just wanted to finish the tour and show you that you actually get this double French door into a giant master bathroom. So again, it's not finished yet, but you will have a big soaker tub, the bathroom, the dual vanity sink, walk-in shower here, and a pretty good sized walk-in closet as well. So you are getting so much space man right right just above that 400,000 and again i'll take you upstairs and show you what all you get in here so you get that cool big window right there that looks outside and right away when you come up you have bedroom number one and another bedroom here the cool thing is they both have their own full bathroom so that one's jack and jill there for the other room but this one right here has a, another bathroom right there that is a full bathroom so I am just super curious. I am polling the audience here before we get into this house, which you're gonna be absolutely shocked. It is fully staged. It's absolutely gorgeous with top finishes for in that $500,000 range. Would you guys comment down below? Is this an area that you would actually consider living? If not, why is that? And what are some of the top areas that you are thinking about? If you guys would comment this stuff, it would really help us with our future videos to get out into the areas that you guys are looking for most. But now, I gotta show you this incredible place. All right, so here we are again in this nice, beautiful Weston home on the south side of town, Jackson. Look at the curb appeal. Again, never disappoint. Man, these are nice homes. We see these in all the top popular mass plant communities, but these ones are typically pretty spendy. Oh, Jackson, check Holy this out. They even, they're even posting it on the windows. So four hundreds? Move in 45 days to eight months. Holy. See, again, that just hits everybody's timeline when they're preparing to sell their homes out of state. And I know, depending on the state you're in, it's varying on that, that, that yeah. selling timeline. Not everything's going in two or three days. Man, I want to see. So usually these houses are in the 600s. They're huge. They're in the, yeah, 600s, high fives. So Holy come on in again. Moly. Make yourself at home, Jackson. What the? It's massive in here. Got a big office right there. Got an office. To the right goes to the primary closet. I mean, it's just nice and open. Wait, you got seller sheets right there. How much? Oh yes, don't want to overlook that. So this right here, just to show you on that price points, the Stop lowest it. is 484, and it goes. That, look at all these homes under construction, under construction, under construction. And they're all 400s, 500s. And let's see here. Look, here's even their 55 foot section, and that's going to be their their top line, 509 to five, they have one on the back side that's 589, but look, in the mid fives, and all these are roughly in that 3,000 square foot, lower 3,000 square foot, square footage range, I was gonna say price point, but no. <laughs> we wish, but still, 400 to 500,000, Jojo, you kidding me? This is nice, and then the lagoon is just right behind us, it's, it's minutes away. It is, and then you have that nice beautiful lake that we were talking about that we passed through earlier. Yep. And it's even got an extra wide sidewalks in order to accommodate the golf carts. So look at this nice open kitchen, Jackson. Yep. It's really nice. Obviously this is an upgrade right here that curves around, but to accommodate it usually steps up and it gives you a real big counter space as well. I dig the extra seating. Yeah, the this is really cool. I, I like that because it's not just a bar top. It really pairs well for not having to use the breakfast uh, table. We don't see that too often, but that's a good idea. Yeah, for... I like that. Man, you got these nice appliances here, gas. But just from this perspective here, looking out, you know, you got the nice spiral staircase and that big open room there with the ceilings up. So again, Curved super staircase, popular. staircase, rotunda again. Yeah, builder here, but south side of town. So they're getting the, the value yeah. down here. And what I really liked about the community is just seeing that a lot of the yard sizes are, are pretty accommodating because everybody always questions, hey, it's so hot over here, especially this week we're reaching in the hundreds here in late, what are we, practically August now? Yep. Um, last day of July, is that everybody wants to know, can I put a pool in the backyard? That's a good question because just to let you know, even if you have a small yard, most, every community is gonna let you put a pool, but you, and most uh, yards accommodate a pool space of some size. All right, Jojo, now show us that master. You don't wanna see this, it's a coat closet. So let's okay. step in here to the primary. Ooh, little step up ceilings there. Step up everything. 
Now this is not included, obviously, yeah. okay? And I think it's a little um, overkill I for this I would hit uh, my bedroom. head on that yeah. every day. But really, really spacious, big, master. And then to take you around, the high-end finishes with the soaker tub. Got a big old shower here. Not only, you know, you got your single sink there, but they do another sink over with here the with the uh, makeup vanity. So us dudes, that's more space than we need. Y'all know that. And then the big walk-in closet here that goes to the laundry room. Takes you right back to where we started when we were invited into the home. Man, that is cool. Custom closets, all that, Jojo. Yeah. Okay, staircase it is. Well, we got the Jojo room over here. <laughs> you better go there first. We all know you wanna go see that media room. It's not the secret room. However, it is a nice accommodating theater room. Man. And if you like the kid, they have the kid that wants to be right across from it, there is a bedroom right over here across the way. Got the bedroom. Yes, yeah, so look table. at the detail in here. Man. Nice room, just a good entertainment room, theater room. So cool, man. Kids little playroom. Yep. What about the little ones and you want to have all the little toys and building blocks all over the place? Here it is, close yeah. the door, everything <laughs> Shut else the remains door. Nobody good. Nobody sees it. My kids would find a way to put it everywhere. All right, so what we're finding obviously is one of the most popular things. A lot of our clients move and relocating here. These, you know, new construction homes, especially these two-story ones, having on the mind. media room here, the movie room, having the big space, spiral staircase. Now you have three bedrooms up here, full bathrooms, and yeah. down below over here, obviously they're using it as their office, but could be another room there and then the office over to the side, and then you have obviously the main room over here. So upwards of five bedroom homes, and we're seeing these, you know, six, seven hundred thousand dollars in other areas here, you know, as we saw in the door, starting in the 400s. So coming south of Houston may pay off big for you. Now, the number one fastest selling community in all of Texas is built by the exact same developer. It is called Sunterra, and if you didn't watch that video, Go click this right here because if you don't want to be that far south, this is probably where you want to be. Go check that out.